I'm gonna do a quick video about how to get your wax out of your warmer the quickest way. I've had a few of my customers ask me how I do it. So I just thought I'd do a quick how-to video. As you guys can see, this is my warmer and it is shut off and the wax is hard. I always shut my warmers off and let the wax get hard. And then I take them and I open up my freezer and I will place it in my freezer. So it's also where I keep my scentsies so that during the summertime and stuff they don't melt and they keep their scent. So anyways, we'll put that in the freezer and I keep it in there for about five minutes and then I'll show you what else I do. Okay, so it's been about, uh, about 10 minutes. You wanna make sure that it just gets cold enough to kind of like freeze your wax. But anyways, so that's my wax. Take it, flip it upside down. There you go. And that is how I remove it. And then this part I can just toss and throw away. And then with this, you just grab a new Scentsy bar and put it in. If there's any extra left over or you flip it over and it doesn't come out, use a butter knife and gently scrape into it and it'll pop right on out. But that is how I do it. And also, when you go to put a new cube in and put it on your Scentsy warmer, don't turn your Scentsy warmer on right away. Let the top get warm, like room temperature, before you place it back on your warmer and turn your warmer on. So you can put your Scentsy in it and then put it back on your warmer, let it get to room temperature, and then turn on your warmer. That way you don't crack it or anything. So anyways, that's how I do it.